Wow, what a week! Filled with news and updates. Elego announced their Jupyter Resin 3D printer. Wambam system is going flexible on Resin 3D printers. And Anycubic's 5th anniversary releasing 7 new 3D printers. Getting the latest news and updates right here on Zachary's 3D Prints. Hello, I'm Zachary and this channel is about 3D printing with tips, tricks, tutorials, how to review news, anything 3D printing or 3D printer related you can find right here. If you're new to this channel and not subscribed yet, please consider subscribing and hit the notifications button to get the latest videos right in your mailbox. And thanks for being here. The Elegoo Jupiter announcement. Elegoo is very busy and working hard to get the first wave out and being tested and shipping around the 22nd of August. Well, in this time, they are also working on brand new 3D printers or brand new resin 3D printers like the Jupiter. The Jupiter, as you can see on this picture, is a very, very huge 3D printer. And when you are taking off the top cover, this one, you cannot, you have a door to access your resin or your printer, your prints. I don't know because I don't have a resin 3D printer yet. Next to this Jupiter resin 3D printer is a wash and cure machine called Mercury Plus. This Mercury Plus is also going to be shipped around mid-September. Prices are going to be around the 120 US dollars. I cannot put a link in the description because there is no link to be shared at this moment. As soon as I have a link to share, I will put it right in this video. Up to the next topic. Wham Bam FBSR or Flexible Build System for Resin 3D Printing. If you work with Resin 3D printers, you will know this little hassle. You take off the print head and then you take a spatula and then you trying to get your model or your part off the print head. Well, Wham Bam comes with a very, very nice solution. A flexible build system, or as they call it, flexible build system for resin, FBSR. Once the printer is done, remove the print head, just flex it right off, or in case of it is delicate prints that you, you are printing, take off the flexible parts. You can use this flexible plate to wash and cure the part, and then after the washing and curing, just flex it right off the build plate. Wambam has two kind of packages, the flexible build system for resin, or FBSR, with one magnetic base, one flexi build plate made from spring steel sheet and one piece of sandpaper. Then the other package comes with double wham for resin or DWR. This includes the same as the other package, but then with two flexi build plates. If you have the need to do batch production or something like that, you can use this DWR package to keep on resin printing. They have eight different kind of sizes for a whole bunch of 3D resin 3D printers. If your, if your resin 3D printer is not there, no problem, just request a new size. I'll put the link in the description of this video. Prices I didn't see at this moment because they are still in pre-order, but I guess the prices are around the 30 till 60 US dollars. And the shipping is going to be around end of August. So you don't have to wait that long because we are in mid-August already. Wow. Link in the description of this video. 
Oh boy, this is amazing. Anycubic 5th year anniversary. And they are going to celebrate it on the 2nd of September. And just like Creality did a half year ago with their 6th anniversary, with releasing 6 brand new 3D printers, Anycubic is going to release 7 brand new 3D printers. Some of them are newer versions or on existing 3D printers that they already have. After, after the 2nd of September, I will be able to do closer looks on some of their new 3D printers. But let's start with the Photo Mono X. The Photo Mono X is a resin 3D printer with three times faster print speeds, a monochrome screen with a resolution of 4K at 8 0.9 inch screen lasts over 2000 hours and has a wi-fi module the early bird price is 539 us dollars then we have the photon mono s e or second edition i guess this is the printer where i was talking about in a video a few weeks ago also this is a resin 3d printer with three times faster printing speed. It has a monochrome screen, 2K resolution at a 6 inch screen, lasts over the 2000 hours and comes with a Wi-Fi module and has an early bird price of 319 US dollars. And then we have the Photon X. This resin 3D printer has two times printing speed a Wi-Fi module, a new matrix parallel light source, UV cooling system, and a high quality Z-axis rail. Price for this resin 3D printer is 369 US dollars. Now we are going to get some upgraded machines and they are all without prices at this moment. Let's start with the Wash & Cure 2.0. This station has a dual purpose, washing and curing of your resin models and parts. A 360 degrees rotatable curing platform, a new interactive operation, UV blocking top cover and an upgraded UV light set. Then we have the 4 Max Pro 2.0 an enclosed 3D printer with a large building volume. At this moment, I don't know how big this printing volume is. Further, it has a TMC2208 stepper drivers for silent printing, a dual geared extrusion mechanism, and a high quality power supply, and an auto power shut off. Then we have the Mega Zero and then we have the Mega Zero 2.0 3D printer. This 3D printer is quick to assemble. It has a rapid heating system and a solid construction made out of aluminum extrusions. It has a Y-axis dual screw rod. Now, what do they mean with that? Lead screws for the Y-axis? And they have a dual geared extrusion mechanism. And they have a totally new solution. The 4 Max Metal. This is a metal printing 3D printer. Simple operation and stable printing. Low equipment cost, lower threshold for metal 3D printing. High consistency of finished products which can realize mass production. The link I will put in the description of this video. So to wrap up this video, so much a very awesome looking resin 3D printers and normal 3D printers. Some can even print metal. All of these 3D printers are going to help the community quite a lot. And some are making resin 3D printing even handier with flexing your prints right off the building plate. All links 
I will put in the description of this video. This video is supported by these Patreon supporters, Tony and Shannon. Thank you for your support. You can also join by supporting this channel. Check the link in the description of this video. If you made it this far in this video, you are amazing. Thank you. On the end card, there are some recommended videos worth watching. Thanks for watching. Please like this video, share this video with other people, and I will see you next time. And hey, let's make some fun with 3D printing. Sakri 3D prints. Bye bye.